Hello. Hadn't been that long, goodness. No. Eight three one eight five. Hmm. All right. Yay. We'll see you. Bye. So the next call is a breaker that keeps tripping. I guess we'll see what we run into. Well, I guess we get to dodge raindrops while we try to figure out why this system keeps tripping a breaker. It is 5.26 p.m. and as far as I know, this is our last call. Got an old Goodman condenser and our air handler is in here. Just for safety's sake, we're gonna trip that breaker, even though it feels like it's not gonna come back on again. Well, I don't see anything obvious. Lugs are tight. I think it's gonna be easier if we're trying to check those heat strips to actually pull them out because I didn't bring 
an adjustable wrench with me. said that when the heat came on, it would trip that 60 amp breaker. That 60 amp breaker is for the heat strips. There's a second one for the auxiliary or out, outside unit. didn't give me much. I gotta love low crawl spaces. Okay, our fusible link is good, our limit is good, but if we go, eh, well, I guess we are good, must not have good contact down here to up here, there we go, we got some contact, up here, we're good, here we're good mm, we're good there so the strips aren't broken and the strips aren't grounded just by turning it on. Huh. Now let's see what we got inside the disconnect over here. It's nice and loose. So nice and loose. Breaker's not warm. These lugs aren't exactly loose. We may have a problem with the breaker inside.
contacts are clean. Here that we've got an issue here. I didn't have power coming, but not coming through this breaker. So we're going to have to get that breaker upstairs back on. We've got 44 amps on the electric heat. So we just kicked I'm going to start with the assumption that that breaker up top is overheating and failing so while we've got power off let's go ahead and check that capacitor Five microfarad reading five microfarad. So we're good. Other than the fact that we're not good. We're good. Call me G.I. Joe, baby. Call me G.I. Joe. This unit has definitely seen better days. Look at them. Well, 6.45, and we are done for the day. Um, 
I didn't have a 60 amp ITE style breaker to put back in there so I had to resort to simply tightening the lugs on it for now and we'll have to follow up and get a replacement breaker for it let me send an email now there we are email is sent well I hope you enjoyed watching the disaster as we go today or as we went today I am gonna go home and I think I'm gonna go watch The Walking Dead that's back on so I'm excited all right thanks for watching like subscribe comment and share we'll see you on the next video Just move.